Hello friends, welcome back to Snowflake tutorial. In this video, we are going to discuss about views and its types on Snowflake. Before starting that, we must know what is view in SQL. A view is the result set of a stored query on a data when the user can query faster with their select statements. And views are playing multiple role on SQL like combining, segregating and protecting the data. Let me discuss in more detail now. Snowflake supports two types of views. First, non-materialized views. It is normal like other RDBMS tools. And another one is materialized views. It follows some caches and stored and whenever we are going to execute, it is going to be referred again. We will see that both some examples in this video. Let me create a non-materialist views now. Here is a select statement that I'm going to select some data from the table. The same select statement I'm convert as a view using view commands. For the view syntaxes, create view, view name as the select statement. Once it is executed, the view will create a, this is like normal RDBMS. Now we can use that view and see the result. Here I just select that view and filter some records with file limit values and it takes 16 seconds. The same command again I am going to execute, again it takes 16 seconds. From this result output we can visualize and see that non materials view will not be stored any caches output. Whenever the query you are going to execute it is going to be shoot and show the result to you. Now we can create a materialized view then see. Now I am going to create a materialized view on the same select statement. Here is the command and syntax create materialized view and view name as select statement. Once I executed that result tab you can see the view will be created. Now I am going to select some record from that view with the same filter conditions on previous non materialized view. Here you can see that outcome as a 0.8 seconds. Again, I am going to shoot the query and it will be reduced there. From this we can understand materialized view will be stored the caches from the previous outcome. From the example we can understand materialized view little more power than non-materialized view. Even though materialized view have some limitations that are Materialized view can query on a single table and there is no joins will be supported in your materialized views. Also materialized view will not be used for another materialized view or non-materialized view both we cannot do that. And there is no UDF and window function and order by having this kind of classes we cannot use it. Thank you to watching this video. Please share your valuable feedback and interesting topics in the comment below. We will work out and make a video as you advised.